Yeah. Sure, Can sir. you repeat your question? What was your actual question? Actually, uh, AI is going to replace uh, replace the human jobs like software engineering, like data engineering, or any testing jobs, uh, whatever the jobs of software field. So you are worrying about if AI can take away your job, correct? Yes. Okay. Right. Thanks for this question. Now tell me, what is your perspective? What do you think? Yeah. Uh, compared to my perspective, out of scale of five, maybe uh, two to three jobs AI may there is a chance to replace, and uh, two jobs maybe non-replaced. Okay, you say that twenty to twenty-five percent of the jobs will be replaced. And... Yeah, out of five, out of five scale, maybe three, two to three is going to replace. Why? Because automation may uh, comes in upcoming years, and due to AI automation, maybe there is a chance. Okay, okay, thanks for that. Any others? Any thoughts? What is your thoughts on this? Before I give the answer, anyone? Perspective so, short. Uh, AI will not completely replace. Uh, mostly the manual intervention is required. That is what I'm thinking. Okay. Come on, anyone, share your thoughts. A very interesting question. We want the answer from you people as well. What do you think? So, so what is the for, question? For uh, the te- this technology, like let's say for the transportation, uh, we used to use bullet carts and everything. So whenever the auto rickshaws or the cycles or bicycles, uh, uh, they replaced with the bullet carts. So over the period, we have we have to get upgraded so that uh, we don't be replaced. That's all. I know about uh, what I'm saying. Okay. Anyone? Anyone? I think uh, due to AI, our jobs will be like uh, more faster because we have co-pilot and all these things, right? But replacement, I don't think so. 10%, I can, I would say like 10% will be uh, there, but 50, 30%. Okay. So thanks for all your thoughts. Let me tell you what is my thoughts on this. Okay. Imagine. Today, I am very much packed. Okay, I have a lot of meetings. I have to go to office. A lot of things I need to do today. Okay, so today, after the class, I don't have time for breakfast. That's my work, actually. So I used to do my breakfast every day. I used to prepare myself. Then I have to eat and then I have to go, right? So today, imagine that I'm a bit packed. So what I'll do, let me go and ask our first best AI, Chad. Okay, so I'll say Chad GPT. First, I'm busy today. Can you prepare breakfast for me? Do you think it will, it will prepare breakfast for me? Do you think? Will it? Yes or no? no? Will it bring a breakfast? No. Who has to prepare? We have to. We have to prepare. What is that chat GPT can do? It can just help you. Yeah. It can just give you the idea. Process. It can just give you the suggestion. Right? Now, maximum what it can do, it can it can provide me a suggestion which I can prepare in two minutes or three minutes. It could be right from two minutes Maggie to five minutes breakfast. Whatever it is, it can just give you the idea and it will never ever replace my work here. I have to go, I have to I have to go to kitchen, I have to go, I have to wash all the vessels, I have to do everything. Maximum what can happen? A robot can help me. A robot can help me. But do you think every person will be able to offer one one robot? Not possible. Now, two out of three people or two out of five people are losing the job. But I'll put it in a different way of understanding. To implement this chat GPT, we have used so much of manpower. Now that is where AI has actually introduced a lot of jobs. Right? Just like that, this tool was not introduced. Right? This tool to implement it, we have to know how artificial intelligence works and what is the process behind it, what is the method, what is the methodology, what is the skills that we are using, what is the programming language you are using. Everything comes into matter, right? I'll agree. What type of jobs may be? Automated. An example, something which you're doing every day in system, right? Every day, let's say like an alarm clock, right? An alarm clock every day at 6.30, maybe it rings. Similarly, every day at 6.30, I want to send an email. I want to do some activities. I want to move the files from one place, one place to another place. Maybe this can be automated, but not the complete process. Imagine I want to build a pipeline now. Let's talk about data engineering. Build a pipeline 
get the data build the data pipeline for me it is just giving you the detail okay as if i don't know the link as if i don't know the link i know what is azure link i know what is azure portal as if i don't know it is the link i am asking to open the account but it is not doing that what when i'll tell you okay i'll tell you when my jobs will go okay when the normal people's work will go i'll tell you the moment i ask this question okay the mouse should be taken directly to the next tab i'm saying okay i'm just going taking and taking to the next tab directly it will go and click this slowly and directly it will only go and type like this portal.azure.com directly only it will create so i'm not typing imagine that there is a ai typing now again i'll go here I'll go to resource group. I have to create one resource group. Then I have to start building the pipe. If anyone who's able to do that, then you may lose the job. It's going to happen. Everyone will they hire one one robo in, uh, next to them and ask them to work. Can this happen? Can this happen? Mm -hmm. Trying to make it better, right? You talk something and automatically that gives you the solution. It can give you only the solution. It can only give you certain things. For example, if I go and ask, hey, I want uh, ideas for this. Yeah, it will give you. Can you give me a small template to do this? Yes, it will give you, but it will not replace you completely right so human is always a human and humans are the people who have introduced ai so if ais are introduced human maybe the case could be different but here humans are the people big brain behind the ai is human brain so if i make to stand on the uh, balancing side your humans will always be on top the reason is those are the people who are introducing ai right their ideas they are trying to make the machines to work that means that doesn't mean that machine will make your humans to work no so the conclusion i would say is yes there could be some drop which could be a very manual work you people are doing maybe that can be automated but the idea the suggestion everything it can give but you have to go and cook by yourself you have to go and sit in the front of the system and you have to build the pipeline you have to go and sit and come up with the implementation there is no one else who can implement for you is that clear now thanks for that question